everyone it's me JB from Unique Tutorials. Today in this video I will show you how to send and receive any file in between Windows and Android devices using nearby sharing. So without further more delay let's begin. So right now you can see my Windows operating system. So firstly on your Windows computer what you need to do is just turn on your Bluetooth device and just right click on the bluetooth icon and just go to open settings and now just scroll down below and just click on this more bluetooth settings and just enable this option this discovery allow bluetooth devices to find this pc just allow this option and click on apply after enabling this option so firstly do this settings and after that just go to the settings and just click on the system and on the right side you will see one option nearby sharing just click on it and now you will see by default you may see it's being turned off so just select this everyone nearby so our windows computer settings is completely done now you can close it now on your android devices what you need to do is just open the play store and in the play store just search for one application name as nearby sharing windows 10 and 11 and on the first list you will see the application just tap on it and tap on install to install this application so the installation is done what you need to do is just enable your Bluetooth as well as the location together and after that just tap on open and now you will see this kind of user interface right so here below you can see one is send and receive option right so in order to send a file from your Android device to the Windows devices what you need to do is just tap on the send and select the file say I will just select this and just select while using the app or you can click on only this time so I will click on the first option tap on allow so you can see my windows computer is being detected just tap on it now you can see on the windows computer you are getting a notification just click on save to receive this file so finally we have sent successfully you can go to the folder you can open the respective file in order to confirm whether it's sent or not so finally we have received so now if you want to receive a file from the Windows computer to your Android devices what you need to do is on your Android smartphone you can see our receive option right just tap on it and here you will get some instructions so below you can see here you need to add your Bluetooth Mac address so you can just tap on open settings and if you're using a Samsung smartphone then just tap on this status information and now you will see your Bluetooth address it might vary depending upon your different OEM devices so in my case this is my Bluetooth address so kindly note down this Bluetooth address and now in this rectangular box which is written a Bluetooth MAC address you need to type the Bluetooth MAC address which I have shown you earlier so let me put my Bluetooth MAC address so finally I have added my Bluetooth MAC address after that just tap on next tap on allow so now my receipt option is ready so now on your Windows computer say I want to send one image file say right you can send any file whether it's a uh, applications or a video or a video or music still you can send any file so here just to give you a uh, example let me send one image file so what I will do is just right click on it and you will see here share option just click on it so you can see it's detected my smartphone just click on it now on your Android devices you will see a tick mark to accept just tap on it so it's receiving 
So finally, my Android device has received a file from my Windows computer. So below you can see there is a tons of details, right? So here you can see one option where the file is being saved. So you can see a location here, saving file to storage, emulated Android media, so and so. So this location might not be available on your default file explorer so if you are unable to find the file shown in this address then you can do one thing just open the play store and in the play store just search for one application name as solid explorer and on the first list you will see the application just tap on install to install this application so once the installation is done just tap on open you can just tap on skip click on I accept the license agreement and click on done on green just lock it down below just enable the solid explorer move back now you can see here under the internal memory section the second option you will see a uh, android right android folder just tap on it and now just tap on this media folder and below you can see the fourth folder with the name nearby sharing just tap on it and now tap on this download and now you can see the respective image file which I have sent from my Windows computer. So using these cool tricks you can send and receive any file in between Windows and Android devices using nearby sharing. So if you never known about these cool tricks then you should definitely give it a try. So if you find this video tutorial useful please click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching.